Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November 27th of 2022 well, it is titled Supernumerary Rainbows over New Jersey. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of a type of rainbow, but you'll see that there are many more rainbows there than you're used to seeing. Sometimes you'll get a often you'll get a single rainbow. Sometimes you can even get a double or a triple rainbow. But here we can see at least five of them in this one shot. Now these occur only under very special circumstances and they occur when the uh, water droplets of almost identical size and very tiny size less than a millimeter across. And in this case, normally when you're in a rainbow, it is from reflection within the raindrops that occur and cause the appearance of the rainbow. So light is bent in the raindrops, reflected off of them, and then comes back. And as it does this reflection inside and being refracted through the outer layers, it splits the color rainbow up, the light up into its component colors. And that will get the red through violet and then sometimes you will see the next set of rainbows as well. Now, in this case of this supernumerary rainbows, you not only get that reflection, but you also get interference. Now, interference is a wave phenomena that is uh, attributed to light being a wave. And we can see similar patterns in a pond when you throw a couple of stones in and their waves will interfere. They will add together to become more prominent or they can subtract and be canceled out. So you can also see this the pro this type of interference in, for example, a wave pool where you get very large waves being generated. And if you're in the right point in the pool, the waves are adding together, giving you tremendously big waves. But if you're in another part of the pool, the waves can cancel and subtract from each other, leaving you almost nothing. And we also get interference is often something that can be used in noise cancellation because you can invert a sound and play the sound uh, simultaneously an inverted sound and the original sound and those two will cancel out and the better they cancel out the better the noise cancellation that you get. So here in very specific situations, and in fact, this very specific type of rainbow can only be explained by light being a wave. And of course, we now know that light not only is a wave, but is also a particle. And this is part of the dual nature of light, that it has properties of a wave and properties of a particle at the same time. So that was our picture of the day for November 27th of 2022. It was titled Supernumerary Rainbows over New Jersey. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.